Many babies and children are born with or develop eye problems that can lead to permanent vision loss. Board certified pediatric ophthalmologist Dr. Eric Lichtenstein at Pediatric IMD in Queens, New York tells us about conditions that can damage the visual system and why it's so important for your child to undergo vision screening with their pediatrician or at school. Children are very different from adults. Their neurologic system is still developing and is very sensitive to insults. Uh, and the younger you are, the earlier in life that an insult occurs to the visual system, the more profound the vision loss and the more long-lasting it may be. And the word for this is amblyopia. And there are only three things that cause amblyopia. One of them is called anisometropia. The other one is called strabismus. And the other one is occlusion. Uh, anisometropia means one eye is out of focus. The brain is ignoring the eye that's out of focus. If one eye is out of focus, the way that we treat this, we put them in glasses. And about a third of the time, that alone will reverse the vision loss, the amblyopia. Two thirds of the time, in addition to the glasses, we'll also put a patch on the better eye in order to force the brain to use the eye that's not working as well, the amblyopic eye. Uh, the other reason why you may lose vision, right, may develop amblyopia, is from strabismus, which means the eyes are not straight. So the eyes can be pointing outwards or pointing inwards. When a child has vision loss from strabismus, when they have amblyopia, the first thing we want to do is improve their vision. And we do that most often with a patch, sometimes with an eye drop. And once we've improved their vision reasonably or completely, then we do surgery to straighten their eyes. And the third reason uh, should also be fairly easy, easy to detect, as would be the case for strabismus. If one eyelid is droopy, that's called ptosis. Or, and you know what? Kids can actually develop cataracts. It's not that common, but it can happen. These forms of vision loss are almost always addressed first with surgery because we have to reverse the anatomic problem. Dr. Eric is the best doctor in the whole wide world. I'm really grateful for all of he is doing with my boy. Pediatric IMD, Queens. Vision care you can trust for your child.